What's up guys, Origin here playing some War Thunder and in this video we are going to take out the Panther D but in this case it's actually called the Panther, I don't even think it's called the Panther, it's called the TV. This is the Russian premium tank, uh, this was given out for one of the events, I don't even remember what event it was but you had to do a whole bunch of grinding to get it and I actually grinded my ass out to get this thing and what I did was actually cover up the whole tank with these peanuts decals so it looks like it's tan. So this way, I basically look like a German tank. So if I'm fighting the Germans, I'm pretty... I can be pretty sneaky sometimes. <laughs> if you ever get this thing like a, a sim battle, it'd be great, but I've never had the opportunity to do that yet. Um, we'll bring out the PT-76, KV-220, uh, PE-2, and TU-2 as well, and then whatever else. I-185 is usually what I roll with because I try to get stuff unlocked for it for some reason. I don't know. But uh, let's go ahead and hop into a match and see what happens. Alright, so here we are on Abandoned Factory. What I'm going to do is spawn at the north spawn and come down here and go towards Bravo area. Maybe go around. Actually, you know what? I'm going to go here instead. We'll go between these buildings and come up between Bravo and Alpha. And hopefully get some side shots on somebody. Why is it not spawning me? There we go. This tank is pretty pretty good. I like the, t the Panthers in general. Uh, especially since they're the first German tanks you can get that have a lot of survivability. Because... You just can't pen the front of these things unless you're using Sabo rounds or something. But most of the time, the hull, the front plate on this, will just bounce shots all day. Which is pretty nice. The turret is... Nyeh. It can bounce sometimes depending on where you get shot. But usually you just get shot and it takes out your guns. But you usually will live through a shot at least. So it's not too much of an instant kill target from the front anyways. From the side it's easy to just aim right under the turret. You get those ammo racks, either one of them, since there's so many. But... I went ahead and brought up to, uh, 25 rounds only, just because I don't need a whole lot of rounds. I, I generally, generally you don't live long enough to use up all your rounds anyway. Once in a while, I'll actually run out of ammo, but I'm gonna call artillery on Charlie up there. We got guys on Bravo also. What are we fighting here? The Americans only. Interesting. So there's gonna be a bunch of M18s hauling ass everywhere. Oh my God, there's one right next to me. He didn't. See, I mean, he has to see me, but I have no choice here. I'm gonna push forward, and uh, maybe he'll maybe he'll bounce a shot on my hull. Hmm. Here, let's rush forward and. I don't know what to do here. Fuck it. Just get killed. <laughs> Fuck him. T-34. Bro, help me out there, dude. He did damage my gun breach, but I don't think he... Well, he killed a crewman, too. Alright, so I really thought that guy would be smart enough to help me out, but... It didn't work out. I'm repairing for eight more seconds. I'm gonna expect this M18 to be on my right side here shortly, I would think. T-34 is being oblivious. And now he's getting shot in the ass. Reverse speed on this thing is trash, so that's definitely one of, one of the weaknesses this thing has. M-18 is making a run for it. He's on fire. He's probably If I was him, I would take my guns out, which is probably what he's going to do. Uh, he's dead, so that's two kills for me. Oh, 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 just got shot from over there. That Sherman, hurry up and reload, and there's another one. Damn, this thing's taking forever to reload. Got that one. I don't know, I think this is a T-14 that was in front of me. I really couldn't tell it was going by so fast. Oh, he's dead. He's on fire, anyway. Engine, horizontal turret drive, so his guns are going to be state frozen where they're at. So, we'll, let's see, how about... Right here. Well, let's just shoot him right here. What? All I got was this loader? Come on. We gotta have guys pushing around us somewhere. I'm gonna go ahead and shoot him in the side of the turret here. 
Oh, how's he still alive? He's still got guys down there? Come on. I guess. Let's try right here. Finally. Damn, I had to pick him apart pretty good. Usually it doesn't take more than one or two rounds, especially on American tanks. T20. Okay. So we got some stuff over here on Alpha, which is unfortunate for me. Call our chill over here. Really don't want to be giving up my side to the right here. Is that a guy? Sure as fuck was. Amazingly, he didn't have a shot or didn't shoot at me. Alright, so let's go ahead and go this way then. Maybe he won't be paying attention. Maybe there's nobody on my left. I mean, there's got to be somebody on Alpha. They just capped it. But I don't really want to peek out. Is that that? I'm just chilling there. Why, why, why is he just chilling out? <laughs> it's another T20, isn't it? Oh, we're at reload. Not really the shot I wanted to take, but the one I had to because of the uh, position he was in. Alright, time to die. Push forward, clear alpha, hopefully. We, do, we are going to have plenty of guys spawn out this way, most likely. That guy just tried to kill something. Horrible decision moving out this way right now, with, with, especially with that airplane just going down. Maybe he just crashed though. Maybe he was actually trying to bomb something. Do, 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 do. Let's get on the cap for uh, the Russians. <laughs> I'm driving around a German tank thinking I'm playing Germans. But overall, I do like this tank. The Panthers have always been my some of my favorite tanks. They got decent mobility. For the most part. Oh, 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 oh. I don't know if he can shoot me. I'll just take out his transmission. He won't be able to move then. Oh, oh. Oh, that's a Panther. Okay, friendly. I don't know if I can shoot through this or not. Maybe I can pull him right between there. It went straight through, didn't, didn't it? I got that Panther's gonna go get my kill, I think. Well, I can just shoot straight through it, right? <laughs> Let's go ahead and get another crewman in here. Six kills so far. Oh, I forgot to give the shout out to the guy that suggested this video. Um, make sure you say cool to this guy here that I have listed on the screen because I don't remember his name. I'll just put it up on the screen. If it's not on the screen, it was before the video. Probably before the video because I'll forget to go back and re edit it. So check the beginning of the video. For the guy's name that suggested this tank, he actually su suggested the uh, Panther D in general. But I thought it'd be more interesting to bring out the Panther TV, since it's a little more rare. And I've been doing a lot of German tanks this week. Well, it looks like we are just dominating their team. I mean, we are the Russians, so at this tier, the Russians are just fucking amazing. Unless you know what you're doing like I do. I mean, I, I can usually get several kills against T-34s and KV-2s and whatnot. Is there something over there, sir? There must be. You were shooting at something. So, yeah, that guy's shooting at something, too. Oh, there he goes. Maybe he'll kill that panther. That canther, panther's going to kill him. Get over here and try to help this guy out. Cause he's probably getting flanked by this M18. Your track's down, and you just got ammo racked. <laughs> How did he not kill this panther? They're so easy to kill, you just shoot them in the side, right below the turret, and they pop almost every time. What? They're on alpha. Time to put my beautiful reverse speed into action here. Call artillery on alpha? Why not? That always, that always gets me a bunch of kills. And by kills, I mean sound effects of <laughs> them hitting the dirt. Because this shit, yeah, I've got like one out of, maybe one out of a thousand artillery pieces, or artillery strikes will kill something. I wish there was a stat for that. There might even be one, I don't know. 
I'm gonna guess he's on this side. Is that him right there? Or is that just an actual bush? I think it's an actual bush. Objective completed. I just got something. I somebody had called an order. All right, now things get tricky. So we know he was just here. But we don't know where the fuck he went, and I don't see any tracks on the ground. Are those just tracks there, maybe? maybe? I don't know. We're going to go ahead and sit here and capture this point, though, while we're already here. I mean, maybe he went out that way. Let's go ahead and just get a quick check going here. Because we see these tracks here. I don't think these were here from the friendlies. I think this might have been the M36. What are fucking plane tracks, man? You son of a bitch. Where is he at? It's probably end up with me getting bombed because I got tracked. He knows I'm stuck here now. Well, I guess he can't tell I'm tracked. Fucking rocket to me anyway, you s motherfucker. All right, then. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to go chase him down in a 185. Uh, I might as well bring some shitty bombs for the sake of bringing shitty bombs. He just got shot down. Son of a biscuit. Whatever. I'm going to bring this out anyway and try to get a bomb kill. Hit the deck as soon as I spawn. We got one guy left. And he just got killed. I live all the way through this game for some fucking plane to single me out of every fucking guy on my team and kill me. I probably killed him and he's like, hey, that motherfucker's over there somewhere. He's gonna respawn at something. Okay. Check the horizon. Look for enemy planes. I don't see any dots. Yeah, he was on the ground in an M3. <laughs> That's gonna work well. Alright, what do we got? There we go, he's down here on the ground. So we got two of them, but I'm gonna go for whichever one's standing still. This guy just took a shot, so. Ooh, shit. Oh, we got an M36. The other one's at open top, so let's see if this will get this guy. Oh, it's on him. It's on him. <laughs> it was on him. <laughs> uh, I fucking love bombing players. What's that building over there? That's a pretty cool looking building. All right, open tops. M10, M36, probably M36. Oh, shit. <laughs> a little too... Uh, a little too hyped to get a kill on M36, I guess. How about... Oh... TU2 time. Let's see if... Uh, I mean, they're probably going to be dead. The game's almost done, yeah. So I think that'll be the end of this round. Actually, I think that's good. Uh, you're going to respawn? There's still something up. There's no way I'll make it to them in time. No, it's done. Yep. Well, not too bad. Six ground targets destroyed, one from the air, six in my Panther. Got bombed by a fucking Corsair with rockets, but still not a bad game. That's, like I said, one of my favorite tanks. The Panthers have always been some of my favorite tanks. And leading up from the start, the first one you get, all the way up to the Panther 2. They've all been decent to me. Let me know what you guys think with a comment below. Hopefully you enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure you like and share. I appreciate it very much. And uh, if you'd like to see a specific tank, go ahead and throw it in a comment below. And if it sounds like fun, hence not the T26-4, <laughs> then I might do it. But uh, thanks for watching, guys. I'll catch you in the next one. Hey, guys. Thanks for watching the video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, don't forget to check out one of these other videos. And don't forget to like and share. I do appreciate it a lot. And I'll catch you guys in the next one.